Hello everybody, Sparkster1701 here, and this time around we're taking a look at a toy that I should have reviewed during the Siege run, but I'm now finally getting around to reviewing during the Earthrise run. This is Rung. Rung, of course, is a character that's featured more prominently in the IDW comics than in most of the other mainstream Transformers media where Rung appears to be a reincarnated form of Primus and primarily serves as a psychological assistant to the Autobots. Or at least that's how I'm taking it from the Transformers Wikia, as I don't really read the comics. Rung was one of the last of the characters to be released in the Siege line, and was one of the second wave for the Earthrise Battlemaster line. So I guess obviously Hasbro figured since he came out so late in the Siege line, they should reissue him in Earthrise to ensure that we get him. Unlike how they released the Soundwave Spy Patrol Team 2, which never saw the light of day around here where I live, and retails online for astronomical prices. At any rate, let's take a look, good close-up look at Rung here. For articulation, well, he can do a fair amount for a guy his size. We can raise his arm up about so far, and it rotates at the shoulder. It's about all the arm movement we get. Head does not move, apparently. We can spread Rung's legs apart about so far. He can bend his leg at the hip just under 90 degrees, and that's it. That's all he can do, folks. But, of course, like other characters his size, he can be transformed into a gun. It's a very simple procedure. First thing you will do is you'll press his legs together to merge them up. Then we turn him around and we will fold up his backpack unit all the way up so that it will cover his face like so. And then we will rotate his arms up. As you can see, there's a little post on the back of his arms, and those should connect into the holes on the back plate. Just exactly like that. And then now Rung is a gun. And like all the gun battle masters that came out, he does have some energy sparks that can be attached to the posts on his feet. Unlike many of the others that were released in the Siege Wave, Rungs are totally different. So they are exclusive to him. Let's take a look at one of them right now. It's done up as a straight bolt, but it does have some energy sort of spiraling around the edge. So it gives it a rather unique appearance. And is done up in a nice trans blue color. So this would probably look great on most of your Transformer figures. And of course these could be attached to the different parts to look like that one of them was shot with it. Anywho. Let's fold him back up. Because there is something briefly I do want to mention to all of you who may be looking for this toy. Is the fact that there are variations of him on the Earthrise lineup. This is the Earthrise one that I bought. And it is the more common release from what I've been able to discern. It may not be as easy to tell on the camera here, but according to the Transformer Wikia, the Earthrise version of Rung was done in a somewhat more muted orange color, and I'm hoping you can catch that here on the camera. 
I do know that from seeing, I can tell the energy bolts here are not quite as trans blue as the originals were. There's a little more white in there to make them a little more solid for some reason. But then just the other day, new subscriber Shampoo Lead sent this one to me. And while again it may be difficult to tell on the camera, it is an exact copy of the Siege Rung. In the same in exactly the same colors. Of course, it may be easier to tell. I'll have them here side by side. Uh, and maybe some of you can see it. But at any rate, if you happen to see a pair of rungs at your store, do take a moment to check them out. Of course, switch it up here a little bit so you can kind of see the slight difference on the energy sparks. Again, I'm not sure if it's coming through very well on the camera. But there is a variation on rung for the Earthrise. So, if you are buying one that's loose, you may end up with one, somebody claiming that it's the specific one. And in reality, it could be either one. So, just something to bear in mind, my viewers, if you happen to be out and about looking for this particular toy. Now, of course, we get down to my thoughts. What do I think of Rung? And it's hard for me to judge Rung as a character, since he's a comic book's character, and I've not really read a lot into the comics. So... As a character, I can't really judge him too much, since I'm not very familiar with him. As a toy, meh, it's alright. The only real problem I have with him is that the Battlemasters kind of were oversaturated a bit in the Siege line, because we got all of them that became different weapons. And then on top of that, we also got all those Micromasters that combined into weapons as well. So, we kind of got oversaturated with them in the Siege line. Well, we're not getting as saturated with them in the Earthrise line. I'm still kind of on the fence. The weapon mode, it does look okay. I mean, the bright orange color means it's going to stand out, so that may be kind of a big gripe, but that depends on your opinion of the color orange. The energy sparks he has are unique, so I will say I do like that. I do like the fact that they're not the same, since most of them were recycled amongst two battle masters, and that got kind of old fast. So, in the Siege line, he may not be as much. For the Earthrise line, since we're not getting as saturated with them, it might be a nice accessory to have. He might make a nice accessory to have. But, seeing as he was one that wasn't off the pegs very long before coming back on, it leaves you to wonder, was there really any demand for this character? that Hasbro felt they had to bring him back within about three months after they took him off the pegs? I don't know. I don't get it, folks. But at any rate, that concludes my review of the Siege and Earthrise versions of Rung. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you liked the video, drop me a thumbs up here on YouTube. If you're new to my channel, please hit that subscribe button so you can join our ranks. Don't forget to ring the bell, because I'm posting videos like crazy this month, and you'll want to be notified when the next one goes up. Also, please share this video with your friends and fellow collectors to help this channel grow, and share your thoughts about Rung in the comments down below. This is Sparkster1701 saying I will catch you all later.